Tell me shit, this is crazy. We're about, to get some potential. We're about to see why King Arthur was legendary and fought so many wars and won! Welcome, Welcome back. back to the Cruz Brothers React. Back, back for more Fate Zero. And we're back with the Octopus Cthulhu fight. Oh shit. Yeah, cool thing uh, RNG mentioned is this guy's writing of Amana from Hindu mythology. That's cool. <laughs> Yo, this man is fucking bugging out. His fucking head is twitching. He's like, ah. Yo, I don't think this guy's gonna survive much longer. He's just watching this go down. It looks like he's hurting him God, his goddamn self more than the, his opponent. Oh, shit. Didn't uh, um, her master say she has a move to take care of this guy? Yeah, but she can't use it, bro. Literally, the only way to get the curse off a of saber is for Lancer to die. So... The What's gonna happen can't here? Do shit, though. Yeah, I know, but I'm just saying she probably try, sneak him. <laughs> yeah, they had to retreat for a second, bro. He's not even pulling out his army because he knows it's not enough. Oh, nice. Just trap it in your reality, Marvel. All right. This is serious. Not even Ryder could take this shit out, bro. He'll trap it for a bit of time, but they have to take that time to create a fucking plan. For real. That Yo, Ryder's about to is... fucking go toe to toe with this fucking uh, Cthulhu yeah, character. And his uh, master is going to be shitting his pants all the meanwhile. Yo, look at this shit, bro. It looks like a wireframe. Holy shit. <laughs> Just I completely it's turned its direction <laughs> yeah, in midair. It's like a UFO. It could go fucking any direction it wants. Can they not see this thing? Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah, they see it. It's hard to miss that big fucking thing. Oh, shit. Here we go. He's going to trap it, Johnny. Can he do it? Mind technique. Marble reality. That should look like the DeLorean. <laughs> Yo, is it even big enough? Yo, what the? F this man is getting hit with the whole rainbow. <laughs> Not the bear roll. <laughs> Shit is going down all over right now, bro. <laughs> all, th all this guy is doing is hurting himself as he blocks every attack. <laughs> He's sacrificing himself, bro. For what? He's not doing anything. He's finally attacking Johnny. Oh my god. Are you joking me? This guy's me? no match for a real mage's power. You can't be a true strong mage unless you have uh, you're born with it. I don't really feel sorry for this guy, bro. On the real, he just wanted that guy's family. He was just a hater, bro. Jealous, bro, envious. He was looking out for the daughters, bro. He already knows what the fuck it is. Mm, that's a good idea. Oh, okay. He wants him to teleport when he comes back to go somewhere else where they can like uh, control the situation. She's literally so fucking prideful that she she says that her battle still has to continue with him so she is going to take this fucking burden. Like that's stupid. <laughs> kill this motherfucker and kill the Kraken and save everyone. He broke his fucking weapon. Oh shit. Is it gone? I didn't know he could do that, bro, but I guess this is how he shatters the curse. And if that's all he had to do this whole fucking time, and they're making it a big deal because of honor? <laughs> no, we're making it a big deal because that was a good weapon of his. Oh, yeah, true, war. true. Well, let's see what fucking Saber's capable of. Oh, Yo, look, it's the revealed. Excalibur. She finally revealed The legendary. It. It's got machine guns? Oh, I guess we're gonna shit. have a test run on this dumbass berserker since his master's already gone. It's no use for him sticking around. What's happening? Holy! He got obliterated! <laughs> Yo, no way. Straight back into a fight. Yo, look, this is what he was waiting for, Johnny. This, uh, yeah, he's gonna take berserkers. I mean, it makes sense, bro. Who the fuck wants Caster? Yeah. <laughs> Let's put an end to this shit. Took out his Yo. machine gun. Took out the whole ship. Damn, why couldn't you do that when you fought him last time? Bro. <laughs> uh oh. This is a Gatling gun. She has to finish it's it in 2B1, one blow. It's 2v1, Chris. 
Lancer and he's Saber. He's falling, Johnny. He can't fucking defend himself. Holy shit. <laughs> and he's getting fucked up midair by Lancer. The debris. <laughs> the debris is also hitting oh, That's him. so funny, bro. Oh, that was uh -oh, Archer? Archer came out to play. Holy shit. What the fuck? Look at this. <laughs> His little ass boat fucking getting pushed away. Holy oh, shit, this is crazy. We're about, about to get see. We're about to see why King Arthur was legendary and fought so many wars and won. I doubt he did this shit, bro. He did do this, man. <clears throat> the Excalibur is what fought, won him his battles. This is something. It was the Sword of Light. Yeah, bro. The power of her pride and her people are in that sword, Johnny. Look at the particle effects. This was the sword. God damn! Holy shit, in one fucking single blow. It's splitting the sea like Moses. She defeated the Cthulhu and cast her Cthulhu. in it as well. Cthulhu, my Bulu, my Kulo. <laughs> Cthulhu, what is that, the female version? Whatever, man. <laughs> what does you all? This guy, what an ending, bro. Hurry up and die. <laughs> Holy shit, that's cool, bro. Look yeah, at this what power, the bro. It's like a fucking nuke went off. Yeah, I got a taste Holy of that power, shit. bro. Let's see what y'all up against. Y'all see? Would you still claim her unworthy? Holy shit. <laughs> They're both her right now. Oh shit. They're the two strongest I've seen so far. He said, I, I'm not gonna insult you anymore, I'm out. <laughs> Our battle will be the final battle. We are the strongest in this war. <laughs> this man wants her as his wife or something, bro. Fucking Arturi is popular in this show. Everybody wants her. <laughs> oh, she, there she's we go. strong. She's noble. <laughs> like, but what yeah, do you man, think, um, Chris? I thought that was fucking cool, bro. Uh, I, I enjoyed that episode a lot. I enjoyed the one before this a lot. Uh, the climax to this whole um, Cthulhu fucking arc was cool as fuck. The way they took this shit out. Um, I do. <laughs> I feel like Saber could have like uh, broke his shit earlier if they knew the grave threat they were doing um, against. Oh, but the, the fact was that he did not know. That's that was the problem. Because in this episode, in that moment, is when he found out that Saber even had a power to destroy this thing. And in that moment was when he decided to break his uh, noble phantasm. So yeah, it does it was, make sense. It was that her he, not telling her. Yeah, it was just yeah. I guess yeah. Because of stupid reason. Because, yeah, because of her. That that's the. She bothers me sometimes, but I get her character, bro. It's literally all for the people. I'm for the people, and my sword gives me the power for the people. It's, it's, <laughs> like, it's a personality straight out of an old book. Yeah, it's like the the like, of an old legend. Yeah, it's shit like that, you know. Um, but you know, that's how kind of the legend was, you know, like how um, King Arthur was and his people and shit like that. Um, but yeah, it, it's it's cool stuff, man. Yeah. Um, so. And then Ca Caster's Caster's uh, um, character was inter uh, very interesting too, and I like this climactic ending here too. Um, you know, in the end, he was slayed by the fucking one person that he thought was like his uh, guardian angel or whatever the fuck he thought he was to her. Yeah. Um, again, that's one of those things where you gotta know more about their character's backstory or something. Yeah, but even from what we've seen in the show, we know that he thought of her as this figure. And yeah, but that's for her all to we end, knew. <laughs> yeah, but he, he, I guess he didn't really go much into the backstory of that, but he yeah. thought that he, she was someone she wasn't, and he, and in the end, he comes to death by her. So animation, obviously immaculate. Like yeah, that shit was beautiful. Top, the little particle effects they had for the Excalibur attack, uh, that shit was really cool. And and I it thought like... also the this episode too from the the discussion in the grill they continued that on as well um in this episode where archer and Ryder were talking at the end he was saying oh do you still think she's unworthy after seeing her power and how how her people make her stronger and he was like he's like it's still sad to see a girl uh uh give up her childhood and everything that she she could have been for her she's cursed by her ideals that's all she knows and all she will ever know like something like that he was saying 
Um, so I thought that was a cool moment as well because that goes back to the grill discussion that they were having. So that's that's anime canon, as you, you want to say, stuff in within the show that happened that I think is cool. What do you um, mean anime canon? Because that never happened in like mythological fucking history. This is the only shit that happened here. Like that whole discussion they had. Oh, uh, just made up shit for the yeah, show. Yeah, like the build, the story built up between uh, Ryder and Saber's character, between all three kings, pretty much. Remember that discussion was uh, between the three kings and this Grail in this uh, in this war. Not all of them are kings. Just because they're heroic spirits doesn't mean they're kings. Yeah. So it's just cool to see that. What would you rate this out of five stars this episode right here? Mm, probably a four. 3.5 to four. Yeah, I'll give it a three. That's just me though. Um, but yeah, interesting episode. We'll see what happens with uh, Ryder and uh, his his thoughts about um, Saber. Cause I feel like they're making that a point. Like there's definitely some uh, relationships like going through, um, uh, you know, an arc of some sort with each other these uh these figures they're having some kind of you know connections and shit so uh we'll see what happens to that we'll see what happens with kid a and whatever he's doing yeah, um but yeah mystery there and what happens what's gonna happen there but appreciate you guys for watching as always be sure to hit the thumbs up button to show your support subscribe if you're new here and uh pledge to our patreon if you want these reactions earlier than youtube gets them by like 10 episodes and in full length you also get movie reactions on our Patreon and polls deciding what animes uh, and movies we react to next. So, uh, yeah, man. Link is in the description to the Patreon. Check it out. We'll catch you guys in the next Fate Series reaction. Thanks for watching. Take care of yourselves as always. And peace. peace.